finding connection when someone is living with a dementia-related illness. Kelly, I am sorry to bother you on a Saturday morning, but I can't get June out of the car, Sue explained while talking to June and me simultaneously. The car sat in the driveway, a stark contrast against the bright blue sky. The morning air was crisp, carrying a hint of dew, and the vibrant spring flowers were in full bloom, painting the scene with their colors. Sue, the private duty caregiver, had just returned from a trip to the ER with June. June, battling the symptoms of a UTI, was also grappling with the challenges of Alzheimer's. Her vision and hearing were both compromised. Upon my arrival, I called out to June before approaching the car. Good morning, June, it's me, Kelly. I let that sink in until I noticed the slightest recognition on her face. Here is my hand. The smell is lanolin, your favorite. Amazingly, June's sense of smell remained mostly intact. Again, I offered my hand and suggested we go inside for tea. Here are a few suggestions for helping someone living with Alzheimer's. To the best of your ability, get to know the person's history story. This allows you to go with them on their journey. Discovering a connection point can be powerful. I found that June loved the smell of lanolin and I used that to connect with her. Find your own lanolin. It could be the smell of cookies baking, music, or old photos. Regardless, this discovery can empower you to make a significant difference in their life. Caregivers can offer a wealth of information. Know what questions to ask and document observations to share with your care team. Clear communication is key. Personalize and update the care plan as needed, ensuring you communicate clearly with the team. Respecting personal space is paramount in Alzheimer's caregiving. Always ask for permission before touching or getting too close to the person. This simple act of respect can go a long way in maintaining their dignity and comfort. Love is not a memory. It's a light that never dims. Unknown. Join our free private community, The Nest, www.thedevotedaughter.com, Thenist.